I think I'll give her a wide berth. Uh, by the way, if you haven't yet sent in your Winter Wonderland competition entry, you must get in the post by tomorrow. Anyway, see you on Thursday. Goodbye. Goodbye. Delight. Starting on Wednesday on BBC One, a new serial for children, The Box of Delights. The mysteries begin when young Kay Harker comes home at the end of term. Well, can I give you a hat? Oh, if you would be so kind, uh, hold me steady as I swing her up, then I can get her to my back, <clears throat> where she rides a triumph. Only I do date from pagan times, and age makes joints to creak. You do keep dogs at Seekings, Mr. Harker. Do you know my name or where I live? Ha uh ha. -huh. <laughs> Magic. The wolves are running. Perhaps you would do something to stop their bite. If you see someone, say someone is safe. Look out for the Master Harker. John Macefield's classic story brought vividly to life with a wealth of wizardry and devilish tricks. Patrick Troughton, Robert Stevens and James Grout star in The Box of Delights on Wednesday at 5 o'clock on BBC One. Well now, we can look at tomorrow afternoon on BBC One, which begins, of course, with Play School at 3.50. Then we're off with Dick Dastardly, Muttley and Penelope Pitstop and the others on the Wacky Races at 10 past four. At 20 past four, Brian Cant continues the Jack and Ori story started today about Erica, that keen motorcyclist who has to change her plans about her holiday. Tomorrow's story, Elsie's Kingdom. Captain Caveman pops up again at 4.35, while it's Gary Wilmot who pops the questions and gives a tip or two to those weedy weaklings who want to be top kid in So You Want to Be Top at 4.45. John Craven's news round is at five o'clock, and then it's up, up and away to go where no man has gone before in Star Trek. And Kirk's crew visit this side of paradise at ten past five, given the grim task of seeking survivors on a planet where they have been exposed to deadly rays. That's tomorrow on BBC One. Now, it's Gloria.